results in just three months. Hey family, I came on to just say what's up with you guys. What's going on? <laughs> Today is Monday, August the 1st. Today was my kid's first day of school. You guys know that. Um, my two younger kids' day of school. Anthony starts next Monday. And... um. Today, I pretty much slept most of the day. I was tired, guys. I had a very, very, very long weekend, and um, and I was just simply tired. I just got out of the shower, um, put on my um, put on my uh, beater, and some um, I put on some boxers, and I'm I'm laid across my bed. I'm chilling. And I'm sitting here reading you guys' messages. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm just now reading and going through you guys' messages. And I just have to say, family, I don't know what I'm going to do with y'all. I just don't know what I'm going to do with y'all. Um, one of my girls did send me a message. Let me go back. And... Um, I got the most beautiful, beautiful, heartfelt messages, and I have to thank you guys for that. Um, um, I got a, a, my fair share of subscribers today, and I welcome you guys to my channel and to my mayhem, my foolishness, and my bullshitting, and my truth. So thank you for coming, and also to my motherfucking homies that's been rolling with my motherfucking ass from the very motherfucking beginning. The, uh... <laughs> Kidding y'all, kidding, mama bullshit. Okay, bullshit. It's, it's a joke. It's a joke. Okay. Anyway, to my girls, it's been rolling with me like forever. What's happening? What's going on with it? And and what it don't do? How about that one? What it don't do? What it look like? You know what I'm saying? That's some old Compton shit, y'all. Some old. Yeah, Compton Swap Me, Long Beach Boulevard. You know what I'm saying? That's that old shit. So, um, but yeah, y'all, I'm not cooking today. Yesterday, I made some um, chicken and rice bank uh, bake. You know, with the um, the the rice with the cream. I you I don't use the cream of mushroom. I use cream of chicken. I also use cream of celery. I also use chicken broth. I don't really add no water to it. What I add is, in lieu of water, I add chicken broth to mine. And um, basically, real quick, real quick, little uh, get down on how I do mine. I um, Just like you making homemade dressing, or some of you guys call it stuffing. You know how, like, you um, saute your onions and celery? Well, that's what I do. I uh, saute my onions and my celery in just a little bit of canola into my skillet or my saute pan, whichever one you want to use. And then after I saute them, whereas they have a little shine to them and they're soft, that's when I add that to the um, to the dry rice. But you know what? I rinse my rice first. I rinse that rice first. Hold on one second. My auntie calling y'all. Hold on. Hey, auntie, what's up with it? Yeah, auntie is burning up. I'm in the middle of a video, like, right now, right now. Can I call you right now? I don't know why I didn't ring in my ear, because I just put my Bluetooth phone. I'm going to call you right back, and just give me a few seconds, okay? All right. Bye. Okay. So, anyway. And so, I rinse off my rice first. Rinse that rice real good, because you want to take a little bit of that starch off of it. So, and I use long grain rice. I like that Uncle Ben's, you know what I'm saying, with the bro on, on the box. Yeah. Orange, I like Uncle Ben's, but any kind is a get down, really. Because even if you buy that rice that be uh, 69 cent a pound and the big old, that had that big old box over there in the, um, over there in the produce section, you know what I'm saying? Next to the Pentos. I know I ain't the only one that done seen it. So even if you go ahead and grab you a pound, a half a pound, or two pounds of them, it don't matter. Rice is rice. All of the motherfucking shit is rice. See, you know what? A lot of motherfuckers get the shit twisted and toe up. And they feel like, you know what? If I buy a no-name brand, that shit is going to be better. I mean, that shit is going to be less than the brand name. Y'all quit bullshit. If you buy a can of Del Monte can of corn, is that corn going to be... Uh, grow, grew any different from motherfucking Kroger brand corn? I mean, come on. I mean, let, let, I mean, let's just put it on out there. If you buy 
Motherfucking Captain Crunch with ter- uh, with berries. That's my shit. That's my favorite cereal in the world. Captain Crunch berries as opposed to the Malto Meal Colossal Crunch. Huh? Is there a difference? I'm just saying. Is there a difference? Or is that Colossal Crunch going to have, you know, the blueberries and the red ones? Is it going to be a difference? I mean, seriously. If you buy another analogy. If you buy CNH sugar. Is that going to be any different from good value from uh, Walmart? Is that going to be? I mean, I'm just saying. Is it going to be a motherfucking difference? Does that mean that this sugar come from a different cane than CNH? I mean, for real. Because, see, and, and, you know, just like a lot of people say, oh, well, I don't eat liver and onions, and I don't eat this, that, that, that. Well, let me say this for the motherfucking record. The motherfucker that cooked it for you might didn't cook it right. That's all I'm saying. They might just didn't cook it right. It wasn't palatable to you. So then therefore, boom, automatically, I don't fuck with it. See, like me, I don't eat pancakes. I don't eat pancakes. I don't eat waffles. And apparently, the time that I ate it, I wasn't feeling it when I ate it. Simply. That's just it. Now, we got Roscoe's chicken and waffles and all kind of chicken and waffle spots. I mean, all day long. But I just never really got on with that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I don't do the funnel cakes. I really don't do none of that. I don't do peach cobbler, banana pudding, rice pudding, bread pudding. I don't fuck with the puddings. Now, I do like the old school chocolate jello instant pudding, huh? Or what about the old heat and serve pudding? The old one. I'm talking about the Bill Cosby one. Let's go all the way back. Because they changed the recipe. They twisted the game up. They twisted the game up, I think, at the end of the 80s. The pudding now is, tastes a little bit different from that old pudding. Just like Pillsbury dough cookies. Why they change up the recipe? Because back in the day, we used to fuck up some Pillsbury dough cookie uh, cookies, the cookie dough in the roll and shit. They changed up the re, they remixed up the recipe. Not saying that it is not as good as it used to be, because actually it's still bomb. I still fuck me one up. As a matter of fact, give me the big roll. You know what I'm saying? I still fuck it up. I mean, just on the spot, no problem. But it's sometimes when they go in and they revamp shit, new motherfucking. You know, vice presidents come in and they want to change up the shit and be like, oh, well, nah, let's not use white flour. Let's go with, you know, wheat flour. And it changes shit up. It don't always make it the shit no more. Huh? All right, family. Mr. Kenny is here. I guess that shuts it down. On that note, deuces, y'all. I love you. I'm out. Bye.